morning, Britain. Breaking news this morning. A nurse has been arrested for allegedly poisoning a child in her care. The infant, who's not been named, died at Birmingham Children's Hospital on Thursday. Susanna, a disturbing and upsetting case that is now the centre of a major investigation here at the leading children's hospital. The comeback champions, Manchester City, win the Premier League after a sensational three goals scored in five minutes that sealed the title for them. But after Aston Villa's goalkeeper was hit on the head at the end of a football season that's been marred by violence, is banning unruly fans enough? Or should clubs lose points if their supporters behave badly? We'll be asking Liverpool legend Michael Owen what he thinks just after 8 o'clock. Plus, was Wimbledon right to serve up a ban for Russian tennis players? Former Ukrainian number one Sergei Stokovsky says those who are against it are on the side of invaders and murderers. Should politics stay out of sport? That's our debate after seven. And find out why comedian Jenny Eclair celebrated her 60th by declaring it her decade of decrepitude and why her naked artists are putting their clothes back on but the models are taking theirs off. After the warmth this weekend, a cooler outlook this week and fairly unsettled. Today is one of sunshine and showers. We'll have all the details of that and more coming up on Good Morning Britain. Monday, 23rd of May, 2022. Live from Television Centre in London. This is Good Morning Britain with Susanna Reid and Richard Maybury. Yeah, good morning. Just gone six o'clock. Welcome to the programme. I have uh, something of great value here in my oh, hands. Yes. These, these have sold out <laughs> in hours in Northern Ireland where they've gone on sale exclusively. They've, they've sold out online. These are rarer than gold bars. This is the new chocolate bar. You've got the golden ticket. I've got the golden ticket, absolutely. I'm going to eat the golden ticket in a second and so are you if you don't mind. <laughs> these basically are the most disgusting chocolate bars you will ever buy. But people do say that they are delicious because inside the chocolate, Cheese and onion crisps. Oh, so it's cheese, cheese. Have you not heard of these, yes. Ramit? These are no. cheese and onion crisps inside a bar of chocolate. Right. And it's divided opinion in Northern Ireland, where they've, as I say, it's the only place so far they've gone on sale. They're coming here quite soon. Yeah. Uh, some people say it's revolting. How hard is it to get into? Yeah, that way? absolutely. <laughs> Hang on. Right. Here right. We, so on the outside, just looks like a normal piece of chocolate. Yeah. Here we go. I know it's far too early in the morning for chocolate, but yeah, it's cheese and onion crisp chocolate. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're sorry, why? But it works. Yes. I mean, it works. You know... You've got, you yes. got the sweet taste to begin with. And, and then, then you, the onion comes and through. And then the onion comes <laughs> through. I, I, I mean, thought, who wouldn't want that? Go on. No, I'd really no. rather not. Thank you very much indeed. It's very kind of you to ask. Can but, I